Okay, now what we've got to do is get the OSB from the trailer, slide it up these two boards onto those two boards, then we slide it up this board, set it on the notch, then we'll just slide it up those boards, land it on the roof. Already got one small piece up, but this little system should work pretty good. We're fixing to find out momentarily. This is plan B on getting the roof decking up. Got a two-step plan with one catch there, one there. Got a safety rope on the end up there, just in case it comes sliding back. We'll try this system, see how that works. Now we've got it halfway up. Now I go to the other side and pull it the rest of the way. Put this little jig in place to keep it from sliding back down. That jig to keep it from sliding off the side. Okay, got half the roof deck up. Now all I've got to do is get up there, tighten up all those screws. Then we're going to go ahead and pull the rest of the roof deck up on this side. And then move it over to the other side. Because I can't get all this rig around between the fence and the shop. Note to anyone, don't ever get your foil covered boards foil side up turns into a giant reflector and will bake your butt getting up early for an early start got a full moon getting hid behind the clouds just about dawn okay bright and early sunday morning i'm getting ready to put the last part of the roof deck up got our scaffold set up ready to slide them up on the deck Got us a chair here on the porch in case we want to sit down and take a little rest. Got my handy toolbox, thanks to Keith. Keep everything dry at night. And hummingbirds are still out and about. Because I'm doing this by myself, I preset all the screws, pre drill the holes, get all the screws in the board. And I screw a 2x4 with a hole in it here, tie a rope on it, rope goes up over the roof, so if I lose my grip or anything, that rope keeps this from sliding all the way back down onto the ground, and maybe landing on moi. Okay, first board's moved off the stack on to the scaffold. Got it sitting on the first set of dogs. Fixing to push it up and land it on the second set of dogs. Then I can stand on the table and shove it on up on the roof. Look who showed up at my house. It's Bob Vila. The master roofer himself. This makes for a much quicker situation. And you got professional help here. Can't beat a deal like this. So we've taken apart our scaffolding. Because everything we need is on the roof. 